Hey guys, it's BSRC here for RC Nightmare. We're taking our break from the usual way of doing things. Usually Jeremy is doing the unboxing videos. I'm doing this one for you guys today because this is one that's pretty important to me. I'm pretty excited about this product. We just picked up the new FMA Direct Rev Electrics Power Lab 8 charger. If you guys haven't heard of this charger, all you need to know is it's the most powerful charger you can get right now on the market, hands down, period. It also happens to be the cheapest charger for cost per watt. If you look at cents per watt, how much you spend per watt that it can deliver, this one gives you the cheapest price. This one can deliver 1,344 watts. Now, if you want to put that in comparison, your standard charger, um, be it, a, let's say, a Triton Junior, Triton EQ, or the Passport Ultra, those are 50 or 100 watt chargers. So here we have a 1,300 watt charger. Um, basically, being able to charge all your batteries at the same time is what this thing gives you. So let's open it up, take a look. This is the uh, com two combo pack that you can buy from them. The combo pack gives you two balancing boards. These are their smart balancing boards. They have built-in fuses, so in case you miswire something, the fuses, uh, the resettable fuses. So they'll go off and you know if you got something set up wrong. Uh, they also give you their standard FMA balancer. This has the USB adapter to hook the charger up to the computer. Full kit there. And of course, the charger itself it also gives you your two charge leads. Now these are the new 40 amp capable charge leads. So they have 40 amp fuses soldered right into them. Uh, they also are true 12 gauge wire, so they can handle 40 amps continuous, no problem. I can, you see here I already have my ends soldered on. They come without any connectors on them, so you have to put your own. And when you're ordering this, if you're buying it, make sure that you get the right balance board. These are the JST-XH balance boards. That's what most LiPo batteries on the market use. Not all, but most. So I ordered those. Let's take a look at this thing here. I'd say the most popular comment I get about this, and you guys will see too, it's kind of underwhelming. It's not a real fancy design. It, it, they didn't try to make it look real fancy. It's just the bare bones. It is an industrial charger. They don't even call it a charger. They call it a battery workstation because of all the capabilities it has. And that I can test for. So yeah, a little underwhelming. The screen size, some people complain, too small. Honestly, guys, the reason this thing looks like it does is so that it is so cheap to you guys. And if you have a laptop and computer, the ability to hook this up and play with the CCS software that they sell for this is just unbelievable. You won't even be thinking about the screen size on here. The amount of features is just unreal. Um, you have your basic output right here and the balancer output. It's just a single output. A lot of people are looking for dual outputs, and that's fine if you are. Um, if you're more comfortable doing different charging methods, you can hook all your batteries up to this at once as long as they're the same cell count, and it's got enough power to handle all of them at the same time. So that's what we're doing. We have tons of light bulbs back here. We hook them all up in parallel, stick them on this thing. It can charge them all in well under an hour. Under an hour, and that's for all our packs. If you have high discharge rated packs, because this has so much power, you could probably charge most of your packs in a half hour, 20 minutes, or even less. So that's the Power Lab 8 heavy duty alligator clips. I'd say one of my favorite features of this charger is regenerative braking, or regenerative discharge, I'm sorry. If you have a pack that you want to discharge, if you have this hooked up and powered off a battery, it will take the energy from your battery that you plug into it and put it back into the battery that's powering the charger. So instead of just wasting the energy, it goes to charge your power supply, or power source, if you will. A lot of fun. Another nice feature, the balance port. Most chargers, when they're balancing, they're bleeding the current. That is to say, they're just using the power in the battery and losing it to heat. They're just using a, what we call a power resistor to get rid of the heat to balance it. What does that mean to you? Well, as a charger charges your pack up, most chargers will charge it to a certain point, check the balance, if it needs to be balanced, they drain it back down until all the cells are equal and then charge it again. That adds up to a lot of extra time going up and down, up and down. This charger can balance charge, meaning that instead of taking power away from the battery, it can charge through that little balance port. So if you have a cell that's a little bit behind, it's catching up while it's charging. That just makes for much faster charge times and the ability to cha charge you know, well, well on balanced packs. So even if you have a damaged pack or a bad cell, this thing can probably take care of it for you. Um, it's just really well built. This thing's been out for about a year now. We got it now because all the bugs are worked out. This is a constant process where they're upgrading firmware. You can charge any type of battery with this, lithium, NICAD, nickel metal hydride, A123, anything you can imagine. If they don't charge it yet, it will in the near future because all they have to do is make a small firmware upgrade. You plug it in your laptop and bam, you got the upgrade and you basically got a new charger with more features. 
So we're going to do a few tutorials for you on this in the near future, showing you how to use the CCS software on the laptop, getting used to the controls here, and how to parallel charge. So keep an eye out for those. But that is the Power Lab 8 from FMA Direct, made by Rev Electrics, guys. We picked this up for about $280 at the local hobby store with this combo pack. It goes for about, I think, $250 if you're just buying the charger if you want to use your own boards. Excellent deal for the money. We're going to show you just how powerful this is in the near future and give you guys an idea of why you buy a charger with this much power. Thanks for watching, guys. If you have any questions, comment below or post up at RC Nightmare Forum so we can get all your questions answered there. Thanks again.